John Vibes is here to entertain you. In life, aside being prepared for all the positivity and the good news that can come your way, you as well have to prepare your mental state because not everyone out there loves you very much. Some people are there to break you, some are there to bring you low and down. And uh, the moment you fail to realize this, then you'll always be disappointed and your heart is definitely going to be broken all the time when they actually throw you in reality. This is the same situation Marco Malo is going through and she was definitely not prepared for what has actually gotten upon her in the real housewife of Duban. I'm gonna say she was just so confident in herself and now things have turned south for her. The drama is getting so loud already and immediately after the dinner, Mark Malo couldn't take it no more. Again, her husband has been going through a lot of trolls as well as he has even been called a polygamous influencer. Things are going so south for both of them and more and more things are about to be revealed about Mark Malo, how she broke down, what actually happened to her so make sure you watch this video right up to the end. Before the entire details, you're welcome to my YouTube channel, do well to subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment after watching the entire video and hit on to my post notification bell so that you don't miss out on our subsequent videos. Tabile Makumalo's black tie dinner on the Real Housewives of Durban seems to be the highlight of this week's episode. After Tabile and Musa actually revealed as the mystery host, the ladies were left feeling rather disappointed by the anti-climatic moment. Many left the dinner with a sour taste in their mouths after feeling persuaded into considering polygamy by Musa Seleko. Mark Malo's debut event on the Real Housewives of Durban did not give the level of elegance that many were expecting. The dinner quickly turned into a seminar about polygamy. Many of the ladies and their partners left feeling uneasy and the viewers felt just the same as well. Tabile Malcomalo Seleko's dinner's party on the Real Housewives of Duban did not hit the high note most definitely. Everybody just got so sad and disappointed in them. Guys, the Seleko's wives are actually owning it in the reality show space. News 24 reports that the ladies are currently hosting a talk show called In Go Makozikazi where they discuss issues centered around marriages most definitely. Briefly notes reported that many of the ladies on the Real Housewives of Durban felt excluded from Marco Malo's black tie dinner because of the language barrier. Nonkanyi so and many of the ladies spent the majority of the night speaking in his Zulu, leaving the English speakers lost in conversation. Viewers of the show have called out Nonkanyi so for deliberately leaving out a whole group from the dinner chats. The Real Housewives of Durban drama has gone far beyond the screen. The viewers have taken to social media to share their opinions on the Isizolo speaking ladies, not accommodating those who don't speak the language most definitely. And this time around, things are getting so south. And everybody wants Musa Seleko definitely out of this reality show, saying that the show is meant for women. And they as well want his wife, Marco Malo, out of the show because they say that the show is about luxurious lifestyle, money, wealth, and fame. And Marco Malo doesn't depict this simply because of the fact that she decided to leave her reality. She showed her house, the house in her local community where she actually grew in the rural areas. I mean, right up to now that she has decided or should I say God has favored her to be among the rich people and everybody was disappointed that they don't want her there since she decides to keep living in the rural areas and being called a rural woman. Things are getting so sad. You all tell me in the comment section what you feel about this and uh, do not forget to subscribe and hit on to the post notification bell.